And now JTP Theatre presents Bite Size Plays with Help Wanted, written by Tony DeMail. A train driver needs assistance from one of his passengers. Excuse me. Yes. Uh, sorry to bother you, but uh, do you know anything about trains? Uh, well, I, I catch one every day to work. When they're running, that is. The times I've complained about... Uh, no, no, I mean, do you know anything about train engines? No. Oh, that's a shame. I could do with some help from someone who knows how to operate one. I'd have thought you'd need to speak to a train driver. Well, I am a train driver. I'm this train driver. Trouble is, I'm uh, not entirely sure how it works. How it works? But if you're a train driver, surely you should know how to... to drive it. Well, the manual isn't very clear. <laughs> well, even had trouble opening the cab door, let alone starting the engine and getting the thing to move. You'd think it would have easy instructions, wouldn't you? But surely you've been trained. Oh, sort of. I did an online course, but I have to say, it really didn't prepare me for the real world. I mean, look at it. It's huge, isn't it? The engine? Y yes, I suppose it is. Look, this is my train to work. Are you saying that you're the driver and you don't know how to operate it? Oh, I've got a rough idea. But I'll feel a bit easier about it if I was sure where the brakes were uh, and the speedometer was in English. What do you mean, English? You know, miles per hour instead of that kilometres nonsense. 120 miles per hour, oh, I understand. But what does 50 kph mean? Is that fast or slow? There's a timetable to think about, you know. Don't talk to me about the timetable. This train is always late, if it turns up at all. I'm here every day. I pay a fortune for a season ticket, and the service is terrible. I've made dozens of complaints. I wrote a letter every week last month, but does it make any difference? Well, if I don't get this train going, it's going to be another timetable failure. Do you think you could uh, give me a hand? What? If you were jumping the cab with me, I could drive and you could call out instructions from the manual. Oh, um, how are you with colours? OK, I think. Why? I'm colour blind. Perhaps he could peep up from the manual every so often and tell me what colour any lights are. Uh, red, uh, green... This is ridiculous. I'm not getting into any train engine with you. You're not fit to be an engine driver, and I can't think of anything less safe than the lives of hundreds of passengers being in your incompetent hands. You'll be helping me out. Improving the service, even. Service? You call this a service? I've absolutely had enough. Late trains, trains that don't show up at all, overcrowding, closed buffets, my multiple complaints ignored, and, and you are the last straw. I'm going home to get my car and taking myself out of rail travel forever. Goodbye. Yeah, yeah, it's me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're like a dream. I think we've seen the last of our serial 710 to York complainer. <laughs> yeah. You can tell the driver he can get going now. You've been listening to Help Wanted, featuring Peter James and Lynn Cartledge, with thanks to freesfx.co.uk for sound effects for music. <laughs>